You're recording now? We are recording. Good morning, Nils. Can you please introduce yourself? Yeah, my name is Nils Turbjörn Nutt. I'm owner of the tourist company Nutti Samisida, situated here in Yucca Serbia in Lapland. I'm working with the reindeers and try to get some tourists here who come into visiting us. Let me just get a brief background. How did, how did you start this business? How, what were the origins? It's a very, very long story, but I try to make it so short I can. First of all, it was very bad winter for the reindeers. I was uh, feeding them. And uh, so they were starving and dying in the wintertime. That cost a lot of money to buy the food for those. So I was trying to thinking, how can we finance that one? And I know a friend from me who owned the uh, ice hotel here in UK Serbia. We are the neighbors to each other. And uh, he was coming with some tourists, and I was seeing it very interesting to learn more about the indigenous uh, point like the Sami culture, the reindeers, oh, etc., etc. So from that I was learning that and see from the tourists that they like this one really. This is something so uh, exotic for those. And that's I was continuing. And they love it that more and more. And we was getting more incoming, of course, from the tourists because they buy souvenirs from us, like the reindeer skins and the handlers, handicrafts. And of course, I'm going to be like an ambassador for the people, telling more about us. So that's the red theme we have in our company, all that we're doing. So you've seen kind of, you've been adapting and growing little by little over the past 15 years? Approximately, yeah, for 15 years ago this was starting, and then it has developed a bit more and more. I have to do, of course, a lot with the history for the famous ice hotel here in Lapland. It's going to be famous more and more, growing, more people are coming here. It's making also becoming more tourists to visit us. Beautiful. Well, I want to congratulate you on winning the juried award for the Indigenous Tourism and Biodiversity website award. Thank you so much. We are very feel honored. And it's very grateful. It's very not just me. It's my partner, Karina. It's me to have this company. Well, I hope I look forward to chatting with her at some point soon, and hopefully meeting up in the natural world. We we were supposed to be in Berlin this week, but that's not happening. So, next best thing thing is this. A uh, quick question: How is the award? process helped you learn about uh, other indigenous peoples or making connections with other indigenous groups around the world? I see that's a very big opportunity because uh, then we get a lot of publicity through the award of course and uh, hopefully media written about this one and, and making some programs and uh, that, that's a very good publicity especially for first of all for the indigenous people and then the next time, the next is that giving a good opportunity for us to make uh, so our small companies are going to growing more and more and that's giving good, better opportunity for us to live so that we always have done. That's why I'm for example working with the tourism. It's not just to be a tourist company, it is to continue with my culture. The tourists give that opportunity and this award of course give that publicity. So we are glad for that. How oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Now you've been learning quite a bit about other web technologies. You're, you're new to Twitter. Yeah, I'm not, at myself I'm not so well done at the Twitter or the technological thing, so I have a little bit help with that one. It's uh, my partner Karina which have designed the web uh, site we have for example. And then we have a lot of help with our employees on this day. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, I it really, it really is. It, it is very. It's very helpful to have Anders there, who can take the time and do the, the the work on the computer. Yeah, we really want to learn more about this technological, so we can use it and getting more contact with other people. My part is taking care of the reindeer. Karina taking about the technological things. We have a fun. You know, one of the other nominees in the award was, is Pedro Martinez. And Pedro is uh, of Zapotec origin here in Mexico. Pedro uh, has had a lot of help from his nephews. Yeah. You know, he's like, you know, I don't, I can't touch the computer. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do that at first. But 
uh, his yeah. nephews absolutely love it. So they've been putting yeah. the videos together, and you know they found ways of making that connection. Uh, do you have any recommendations for other indigenous tourism businesses about how they can best use the web to make contacts? Well, first of all, you must have a good website, and which is uh, giving uh, good information what you're doing, and try to find selling points what you are doing. With. And uh, I think it you must be very try to be very correct because, uh, for example, we when you work with a culture tourist that we are doing, we are uh, like a tall. We're ambassador for the folks, all the group. So you must be very correct with all the information, first of all, and so it seems to be genuine and real. And uh, if you look, for example, up here in Lapland, the Sami, the Lapish people are quite known and, and, and uh, handicrafts we have. So it's not just the Sami who are producing that kind of thing, things and taking advantage of that one. So that's what I mean, you must be, you must try to have uh, some uh, uh, what do you call it? What kind of an American brand? A brand to getting out to so feel really good and really it's real, and that's what you must try taking out of the website first of all. And uh, the new technology of Flickr, YouTube, and uh, Facebooks and everything that's helped you a lot to have this contact with other people and, and chat, for example. I don't know so much about it yet, but I have learned it more, more and more. Just today, for example, it's so easy. It is way. easy. If you if if it works, it's easy. Yeah. <clears throat> well, it's thank. It's a good you. opportunity, really. Say, I'm sorry. Repeat. Yeah, it's a good opportunity that you must take and learn and use. Beautiful. Well, I want to thank you for your time ch chatting with us. Anything else you'd like to say? Sorry, I didn't hear that. Is there anything else you would like to say? Good luck for everyone. I hope we can meet each other in event where it's going to be. <laughs> I try to. I'm interested to have cooperation with other people, and this is a good chance for that. Perfect. See you. See you.